All right, this is the first one in a very long time. I tried to build on a little cheap generator. Basically, it's just a, actually a 2.7 horse, I think. Might be a 2.9. All I know is it's really close to a three horsepower a little like mini bike motor. You know those, uh, you know those uh, doodle bug, you know those little doodle bug uh, mini bike motors? That's basically what it is. And I got it powering an alternator. And I built it in five hours. Five hours, that's all. With a good welder, a sawzall, some uh, scrap metal parts. He used a lawnmower blade as the main bracket on the bottom. And uh, cut some old Murray front end up. And uh, this is an old, old alternator too. I think it's like from the, it's a 70's alternator. That's how old it is. Now let's check this thing out. I got it running right now. It's actually powering a little lamp. And uh, right now it's getting up to 14 volts. I hooked on that battery and it, it's under that. It's under a really heavy load right now. That engine's at full throttle. And uh, it could power a lot more, but right now I got it powering something small until that battery charges up. All right, here we go. Let's check this thing out. It's starting to rain, so I covered it up a little bit. But anyway, check it out. Oh, foggy. There you go. You see? It turns the alternator. Just like that. I mean, it's about slips a little bit, but that's kind of okay because it needs to slip somewhat. Ooh, look. 14.1. She's been going up. Powering that little lamp right there. She's a teeny tiny little inverter. This thing has been running for about two hours straight right now. And I only put in about a... Oh, shit. My light bulb just popped. Huh. Well, I guess I better get something else to plug into it. That scared me. I think a raindrop from above must have hit it or something. Anyway, that's my, uh... That's my homemade... That's my homemade generator. See you later. Bye.